Hi one! Hello! This is Mike and that's Jenna and we are back from our uh well, I'm not even gonna lie, it's <laughs> we're, we're, it's like April 2016 now. <laughs> We've been back for a long time. Uh this is this is gonna be our Disney haul video from our trip to Orlando in 20, 2016, no 2015 sorry. Uh, we've been back since, so that's how long it's taken to do this video. And uh, basically all this stuff has been sitting in bags. Just we, waiting just, for this video. <laughs> and then we can finally distribute it around the house. But uh, yeah, so we'll start with, we got kind of free bags of stuff. Some of it is stuff we bought, some of it is stuff we just collected. It's From not all I Disney either, right? Oh no, it's not all Disney mm. either. It's, it's an Orlando haul because some of it's Universal Studios, some of it's down like Old Town. And, yep. You know, there's loads of stuff, loads of stuff. So let's begin. Yay! And so there's three bags, and it's been so long I can't even remember what half the stuff is going to be. Do you remember? Amazing, Amazing pictures. pictures. No. Is it? Don't the, you really? It's like what we argued it, about. Is it the balloon? It is the balloon. Yay! Hey, there's I'm wearing that shirt right now. <laughs> I can't see if I'm actually getting on the camera, can you tell? <laughs> it's on there. It's on there. That's yeah. us. Uh, in front of the balloon. They don't take a picture while you're inside the balloon, I guess. Not really logistically very feasible. Yeah, to get everyone, I guess. Yeah. It's a bit tight up there. Good job. Yeah, this is not gonna this is gonna come out in like a random order by the way. It's, just, <laughs> it's gonna come out as we find it. Yeah. And I feel like you may have already shown this, didn't you, when we got showed it already, we, you know. This doesn't, is the whole I can it's pretty cool. I Disney I had parks. my hesitations, but yeah, okay. It was fairly expensive. It was like eighty dollars, seventy-five dollars. Ah, <sighs> the prices on the back just just stupid. But there's only one thousand of that center pin. That Mickey pin in the middle, Mickey and Minnie. There's only one thousand of them. And you have one. And when we when I bought that, I went back. We went back a little while later, and they're all gone. So we were in there. Yeah. You know, sorry to all those. Uh, Serious pin collectors out there. Suckers. Who actually do collect them. I bought one even though I don't really I'm not a massive fan. Do I deserve it? I don't know, but I'm sad I got I got there before you is all I can say. <laughs> and now we have some non Disney things oh, yeah. that are still some... sticky, that's lovely. <laughs> oh yeah, we probably should have washed them when we uh, got back, but <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> there's flaming our flaming mo cups. Mo -cups. That we got when we were at Universal Studios in the, the Simpsons Land, which is basically, if you don't know already, it's just like Fanta. It's just like orange aid. Orange soda. Yeah, orange aid with uh, in the bottom here they have. Oh, yeah. uh, As you can see, there's like a little separate space for it. Yeah, in the space below they have dry ice or what's it called? I think it's dry ice. Isn't yeah, it but what's the? There's no see... Hydro something chemicals. Sea hydro something chemicals. <laughs> Has that at the bottom. Which <laughs> don't eat it. <laughs> which gives it the bubbly. Which people have actually died drinking that stuff, but when it's separated it's okay. We're still alive. Yeah. And then this one, I don't remember when you got this. Yeah, I one. got that when so this is the uh, Universal Halloween Horror Nights twenty five. And I got that when we went to the bar section before because we went on the RIP tour. And ah, and you had to carry it around the entire time. I had to carry it around for the rest of the night, which is a bit of a pain. But it does light up, doesn't it? Yeah. Ooh, oh my. Look at that. I think you can see that. But yeah. It <laughs> totally was... worth the uh, like $18 you spent <laughs> on that cup? It was a lot of money, actually. Had a uh, rum and coke in there, though. It was pretty nice. Alcohol. Alcohol. Oh dear, here we go. Yeah. Imagineer in the Magic DVD. The Magic Kingdom version. Which I have to say is nowhere near as good as the Disneyland version. The Disneyland version was uh, had a lot more. I don't know. It was, it, it was a lot longer. It felt and uh, more Tony Baxter. Yeah, more Tony <laughs> Baxter. And uh, I think in this one too, actually, the uh, DVDs are backwards. Like they're printed as like can you see that DVD? That's DVD two, but it's actually DVD one. Because when I put it in, I was like, well, that's really strange. So. An error, an error there. Someone on that assembly line got fired. <laughs> so yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, it was 25 bucks, which, you know, Sweet. depending on, you know, I, later on I found out you could watch it online, but, you know, it's still, I like it, I like to own, I like to own these things. Plus I like it when they update them and you get new ones. Here is 
all of the money we spent on yeah, we too went to many things. Disney Quest and uh, pretty much drew every picture they were offering, or every character, sorry. Let's just do a quick sample of what's inside. So, of course, is the drawing that you do. I don't want to rip your paper, so I'm going to take it all at once. Take it out. Oh, this is actually, yeah, this one's actually yours. Hi, Drew Goofy. That's probably the best one you did. Look at that picture. What a good one to select. And you get a little certificate saying that you've completed the uh, Art Academy. Which I don't know. Animation if, Academy. Which I don't know if you realized actually has the Disney Quest logo on it. Yeah. So, yeah. super collectible when, once that's When Disney Quest eventually shut down. shuts down, if it ever does, they say it is, but I, st I don't think it's still shut down. I think it's still open. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. You got other stuff in there too. Yeah, I'm just struggling. Oh, I thought you were putting it back. So, and there's two. One is fun facts, and I think the other one is like a little bit of history or something. Fun Whoa, facts. Well, the fan is blowing around. Fun facts and history. Mm. And there's also a how to draw Mickey Mouse in there too. Is there? Yeah, which you neglected. Oh my god. There you go. We don't want to give away all the secrets. How to draw Mickey Mouse. Bing. There you go. Snap screen. Snap screen. Screenshot that image, and then you can draw it. More Disney Quest stuff. Yeah, we went to Disney Quest. You can go on Cyberspace Mountain and create your own ride. We created the Turbo Trolley. Turbo Trolley. What's funny about that is when you go to the uh, the counter on the back, it has like VHS tapes and DVDs saying you can buy this stuff on the video. And then even if you buy the DVD version, it comes out as VHS quality. <laughs> it's still very. Uh, which you love, don't yeah, you? Yeah, I, I love it, don't get me wrong, but I'm sure that people people out there are probably like, What the hell is this? This is 2016, you should have like <laughs> HD, Blu-ray... But I enjoyed it, I like the VHS quality of it. So, yeah, it's basically, I can just see it's a purple disc, so it's just a... Just a run-of-the-mill copy disc, basically, that they're... Which is probably illegal. Come on, Disney. <laughs> to add to our now-growing collection mm -hmm. of Magic Bands, I got the... Now this, that's interesting actually. Am I holding it upside down? We've I think I am. <laughs> there you are. This one is the uh, Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party Magic Band for 2014. I looked it up and at the time I didn't realize it was. And as you can see it was only, it was only 15 bucks from a uh, Disney outlet. Now what's good about this is I, I like to only generally buy Magic Bands for events we went to. But we actually did go to that. We went to the 2014 Very Merry Christmas Party, but I wasn't really, I didn't collect the Magic Bands then. So it was like, this it's like fate. It's meant it to like be. popped into my life, and there it was. It was amazing. There's only like two left on the shelf or something? Yeah, it was very, yeah. What are the chances? Yeah, and she was still trying to talk me out of it, like she always I still does. still am. But I'm trying to track down the uh, Halloween one, because we went to the shop while we was at the Halloween thing. But they were sold out oh. way before. You know, if you want to get that stuff, you probably have to go on the first night. Because she was saying that they've been sold out for ages. Although the Hocus Pocus one was still for sale. But I didn't want that one. I wanted the, you know, the very, merry, uh, very scary Halloween party one or whatever it is. Not so scary. Not so, oh yeah. Very <laughs> Not scary. Not very scary. <laughs> very <laughs> scary would be quite fun actually. I quite like that idea. But uh, yeah, it's a shame. But I'll track it down one day. And the reason I haven't got it yet is on eBay it goes for like 100 bucks very expensive but I will get it. If someone's watching and has one and wants to give it to us like <laughs> Yeah if you want to give it to fine. me in the box, pristine condition, unworn then <laughs> 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 feel free. But uh, yeah I will check it down, I will buy it eventually. I'll probably cave and spend loads of money on it just so I can just so I have it. But I like these little boxes that the special ones come in. I won't show you it now but we did pick up another one in our January trip too um, which we'll show in our cool video from that trip. Mm -hmm. But yeah they, these are funky. And then, not, not in the funky box. our next magic band, which again is awesome for me, because they, they do dated magic bands. So that's awesome, I'm gonna get one of these every time. And uh, again, I won't show you it now, but I did manage to get a 2016 one as well. It's really weird doing this when we've already been back to Disney. It's hard to like, it's, it was hard to try and figure out what we, like, what we bought on which trip. But this was definitely bought in November 2015, so there you go, magic band. Scrapbooking supplies, which is kind of ironic because we've only just finished the, uh, well, it's not even fully finished, is it? Or is it now? 
our Disneyland uh, 2015 scrapbook we just finished, I think. So we're going to start on this one soon. What do we have here? Definitely not Disney. Yeah, this is a uh, where you dress up. What's it called, that place? There's a CD over there. Portrait Gallery. Yeah. Old you know, Town. Old Town Gallery. Portrait Gallery. Which is a place you can dress up and stuff. Uh, it's fairly expensive, actually. I'm not going to lie. For prints and a CD, it's like 90 bucks, isn't it? Yeah, it's probably about 80. Yeah, I think it's close. It's close to 100 bucks for that. But, uh, Fools that we are. Yeah, we've done it twice. Uh, first time we did it, we were like cowgirl and cowboy. And this time we were like. Steampunk? Like, steampunk couple, something. <gasps> it's a coloring book! Because I'm five! Yeah. We should actually do that. I would actually really like to color it. I know adult coloring books are really popular now. But well, they are in Canada. Good, right? man. Yeah, but look at that. I'd much rather draw that. Those are so much. Like, it's not even about being easier to color. color it's like. It's just, it's just good. I just love it. I just love that. Just love that. Look at that. That hat doesn't exist anymore in the place where it's supposed to be. We could colour that hat in and remember. Remember the good times. <laughs> so this is to go with your hat. Because you're the oh, yeah. spoiled birthday boy. Unlike Disneyland, it actually was my birthday when we went to uh, <laughs> <clears throat> we went to Walt Disney World. So that that's a legit badge. And those are just extras, but these are kind of like the ugly Yeah, we tried, uh, we tried hard to track down uh, there's a really nice like one. That we, yeah, we saw we saw a uh, a girl at Animal Kingdom had a really nice one on her bag, and it was kind of basically this one but silver. And we tried to chuck it down, but we couldn't. Uh, so eventually, we bought it. I bought it on eBay instead, which was this one, which is basically yes. as you can see, it's the same. So the difference the is that the shiny one is the 20th anniversary. Yeah. <clears throat> which I don't know um, but they also do have like specifics on them, like the red one has uh, Disney's character warehouse on it too. Like, and I think this one here is, uh, oh it doesn't say Animal Kingdom on it, but we got this one from Animal Kingdom. And we got this one from, like, what do you call them? Outlet, like a Disney outlet, right? Yeah. And then this one we got on eBay. Yeah, I like this one the best because it looks shiny. It's like when you get a shiny Pokemon card. Um... Remember when we used to collect Pokemon cards? How much did you spend on the shiny Pokemon? I don't know, not very much, was it? Didn't you spend like 15 bucks? 15 dollars maybe, yeah. <laughs> but, charity. The next one, I'm kind of annoyed about because it was in a section I thought it was going to be like 20 bucks. I think yeah. it ended up being considered 40, but it is a really nice picture of your room. So, you know, we'll just suck it up. Uh, that actually, we got that from the, where we got that badge from. Yeah. yeah. Same place. It was behind the counter. They had a, they had quite a few, but some of them were like random. I seem to remember from some some of the pictures being not amazing, and that's why they were still there. It was mm. like a random hill or something, <laughs> something weird like that. And, but this one was behind the counter, and yeah, Jenna thought it was going to be on sale like the other ones, but it wasn't. Oh, it's got a little artist bio on the back. Yeah. Yeah. Don't know where we're going to hang it, but we will eventually. We will eventually hang this. I promise. Art. Things to post yeah, so when we went to Disneyland, we bought the ride uh, ride posters. So I thought, well, we go to Disney World far more often than we go to Disneyland. <laughs> so we'll buy the Disney World version, which is awesome. And again, we will eventually hang some of these. Uh, which one do I want to be hanged? Hanged. Did, did. Probably the Haunted Mansion one and the Pirates of the Caribbean one. This is something we didn't buy. Well, technically we got it as part of the meal package. Yeah. But, who knew it's a birthday card? Birthday card to me! From who? From all my bestest buds. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. I do like that. Uh, still, uh, we got that Animal Kingdom when we were eating at the Tusker House mm -hmm. buffet, which Jenna doesn't like. She doesn't like buffets. I just don't think they're very well paired with theme parks. Eating, overeating food, and then going on rides and walking around in the heat to just not it's conducive. Up you, it's up to you to overeat, though. You don't have to overeat. You don't go to a buffet and not overeat. <laughs> but 
Yeah, yeah, I'm still in dismay that someone left their birthday card on the table. We could have got that and like yeah, put someone, that in a giveaway. Someone left it there, and we were considering nicking it, <laughs> but we thought maybe <laughs> if it was like a, it's obviously more than likely for a young kid, and we thought if they come back and it's not there. Not the, well, they could just sign another one. They could get another one. I doubt they sign them on the day. They probably, they probably <laughs> like got hun stack hundreds of thousands of them. <laughs> <laughs> What's next? Oh yeah. So on the same day we went to the uh, Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, we also went to Clearwater. Um, What's inside? What is inside? I feel like one of these is going to be empty. Yeah. Because it's somewhere around the house. <laughs> empty, yeah. We have uh, that picture somewhere. We'll have to find it. Look what you found! <laughs> yeah, quick cut. There we go. We found the picture of us with a dolphin. Yeah, a picture with a dolphin. But that, again, cost extra. Everything cost extra. Yeah. All around there. And then the next one, I think it's going to involve turtles. Yeah, it is. Baby turtles. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, it's well, us. I had my hair in the Anna braids, and then we never dressed up in our costumes, so now my hair is just in. Oh, yeah, we were going we to go as Anna and. Um, How's it going? <laughs> Christoph. Yeah, Christoph. <laughs> but uh, the drive back from Clearwater took a little bit longer, and I wanted to get to Disney uh, Magic Kingdom as soon as. Um, and we also got this little dolphin keychain. Which had all our pictures on there. What are you gonna do? The fact that it's so cool is because the dolphin that's there is the one that doesn't have a tail. Oh yeah, winter. Yeah, that's the that's the big draw for that place at the moment is hmm. that it's based on uh, Winter's Tale, that movie. And although I have to say, when we did see Winter, she was just like floating. Yeah. <laughs> she was like she just looked very happy. <laughs> just floating there. And then, uh, but when they put the tail on her and stuff, then she went crazy. She was going backwards and forwards and doing all sorts of stuff. So, yeah. I like the bag. I don't even remember when we got this. The World of Disney. I guess we got it when we went to the World of Disney. <laughs> yeah. Which is oh, so glad we got these. Oh, it's crap. More playing cards. But did you know it's crap? No. The case that it Oh, I'll live. Pirates of the Caribbean, and what's awesome is two reasons I like these. One is that these images are really like old fashioned, like they're old Disney, like 90s Disney. <laughs> and uh, although, yeah, even on the back you can see they are. But these ones, are, these ones are the best because they look like that on the front. But when you actually look at the cards themselves, apparently, hopefully this isn't just the box lying, but they look like that. How cool are those cards? Can you open it and find out. They're awesome. Uh, should we open the find? Oh, there you go, you don't even have to, but there's the Joker. The first <laughs> card in the pack, so... Yeah, they're cool cards. I don't play cards. Um, mm -hmm. And we have our, we have the 60th anniversary ones above Jenna's head there. Mm -hmm. But, um... And then we go with the Mario ones, and the Princess Bride ones we have. Yeah, and we, then have, like, we have a lot of playing cards. There's some more out there, isn't there? I have Ninja Turtle ones, <laughs> and there's Ghostbuster ones. Or something. Just they look cool. It's, it's, it's disappointing when you buy cards like that and they are just regular cards on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> but when they look like the Pirates of the Caribbean ones, then they're pretty awesome. Like the uh, the 60th anniversary ones up there. Like, look at them. They're amazing. Like, that's the, that's the front of the card right there. Yeah, so for those of us who are following the travel vlog, you'll remember my pocket full of Hard Rock Cafe. Hard Rock Cafe? Is it the cafe? Hard Rock I don't Cafe know, what are they, restaurant. They stir sticks. Yeah. Hard Rock restaurant. I don't know. But yeah, Jay, Jenna asked for like two. For the scrapbook. Yeah. We're gonna put them in the scrapbook, and she said, "Oh, oh no, please. take a whole bunch of them." So. Thanks, lady. Yeah, loads. And she, she you carried them those. around in your pocket for the rest of the day, and none of them snapped. It's good durability. There you go. Then we have our Halloween Horror Nights 25th anniversary uh, VIP pass. R.I.P. I would suggest anyone who's going to this to do that because yeah. the queues were immense for those houses. It was like 90 minute wait at every single house on that night we went. But if you're a VIP person you can just walk straight past everyone. And then laugh at them. Yeah, you get to see all their little jealous faces as you walk <laughs> right in. It's awesome. And you get to go down to the Men in Black thing and meet uh, Bob and Hello! whatever his name is. Where's the call? <laughs> Where his name is? Those, those little guys, the little squid fellas. Are you ready for this, Mr. Box? Another pin. Wow! A big Ooh, 2015 pin. 
Look at it, it's huge. There's only the 500 of them. And uh, yeah, again, we went back, they were gone. Oh no, actually, no, that's a lie. There was some of those left. Why behind, the, behind the counter, there was some left. It's a. I don't actually like it as a pin, but. Like, it's a. Like, who wants a huge pin of that size? Like, it's big. But. <laughs> it is. Uh, it had the year on it, and I'm a big sucker for buying the year on things, because I know that in, like. Like, if I went to Disney World in. 1992 and I still had all this stuff that would be amazing so I'm hoping in uh, 2035 when, when I'm an old, sad, man, old man when I'm a single sad man where have I gone I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna look back and be happy same with our hats oh we bought these two there and they have 2015 written on the back you yeah yeah trust me that's <laughs> And next we have our badge, because we went on the uh, Disney's Keys to the Kingdom tour, which uh, was pro one of the... I think it's my favorite. Of all the tours we've done? I think so. I think, I, I think it just hit a lot of high points. Yeah. The uh, tour guide we had, do you remember her, the girl? She was very, she was good. She was very informative. I guess you have to be <laughs> in that in that scenario. But yeah, she was fun, and uh, we got to go on the Jungle Cruise, and we met some nice people on the tour. Um, yeah, it was good. I think all the tours have been good, but that one was just a little bit extra. Yeah, I I enjoyed it too. So last but not least, we're going to show you the pins that we got. I know we've shown some pins already. We got the Halloween ones, but we also got these pins too. Uh, 20, again, I'm a sucker for dates. I like dates. So we got the 2015 pins across the top there with the, the each park on it. And then underneath our little uh, thing there, we have Mickey Mouse. It was 2015. That was a, a separate pin altogether. Like those top four came together in one package. And then the Mickey Mouse one, it's hard to show it, that came on its own. And then moving on to the. Uh, Keys. Keys to the Kingdom. That's the that's the keys you get when you finish the Keys to the Kingdom tour. Uh, you get, like I said, we get you get a pin at the end of every tour. And then, last but not least, are the Disney Quest pins. Uh, two of which we tried to get when we went back in January, and they didn't do them anymore. So these pins are now sold out. Three of which. I think there's only one left, isn't there? No, there was two. Oh, okay. Either way, they're selling like hotcakes. Goofy and Pluto were the only ones left in January 2016. But when we went there, we were able to get Minnie, Donald, and Goofy, and Pluto. Sadly, we don't have Mickey, although he is available. On eBay for yeah. $35, $40. So we'll probably track him down and try and get him. But yeah, that is our whole video, ladies and gentlemen. Yay! Thanks for uh, coming with us on our adventure through Disney World in 2015 it was fun yeah thanks for watching and we'll see you in january 2016 when we go back to disney world mm -hmm. and uh yeah what was our well we planned to go back because disney quest was shutting down apparently it's still open so it's a disney quest centric travel and it's only a short trip so it's only gonna be a few videos but hopefully they're still fun thanks for watching guys